So guess what just arrived, guys? I have BTS's new Japanese album. This time it's an album and not a single, so it was very expensive. But I did get one set from the Universal Music Store because the gift sounded a lot better there. And I kind of peeked into the box already, but it kind of wasn't exactly what I was expecting. But it's still cool. It was more than just photo cards because photo cards was all that came with the Japan fan club. I do also have the Japan fan club CD itself on order, but apparently they haven't shipped it yet. It said it should all arrive on the 14th, but when I looked it up, it hasn't even shipped yet, so I'm probably not going to get that for a couple days, sadly. It's really stupid, it really sucks, and it's mainly because of the current situations right now. They're always really like behind with their shipments and stuff, and if you have multiple orders, they don't ship it all at once either. Like They can come days or weeks apart. So hopefully it won't come too late because I do want the serial numbers that are in it and the sooner I get them the better. When it does arrive I will post a picture on Twitter but like I said I don't have it right now so I'm just going to show you everything else that I do have. So first we have the pre-order gift and it did say a storage case like that's what it translated to in English when I looked at the Japanese. But I was kind of thinking it was going to be like with their previous albums where it's like a box that you can put the albums in. But I guess because they actually have only two CDs and the rest are like big bulky ones, they didn't have a box for it this time. So it's this. Let's go ahead and open this first. So it's a cute little case. You can always use it for something else. But right now the photo cards are in it. And it did come with one full set. Ooh, and they're like hard ones. They're kind of like acrylic ones. Like, it did say clear photo cards. So I guess when they said clear, that meant, like, acrylic. So they're, like, thicker than the normal photo cards. And there they are. That's so cute. Oh my gosh, I love that. That's all so beautiful. And so next, I have the regular album. Or, I'm... Um, this regular CD. It's just a CD, nothing special really. Uh, it does come with a photo card inside, so I'm excited to see that. They kind of tease the photo cards, but it's like they fuzz it out so you can't really see it. I just hope I get Jimin. Now, I do have two of these, and I am considering doing a giveaway, but because of the situation right now, I actually can't mail it out right away. So I'll let you know by the end of the video if I decide to do a giveaway. It was an expensive album, but we'll see. I'm going to go ahead and open it first. And again, I'll let you know at the end of the video. So I think this is actually one of my favorite covers from when I've seen the covers. But, you know, I love them all. But this one is a really beautiful one. And if you just look at the CD, it's so beautiful. Like, I'm assuming all of them are going to be different. Or they could be the same. I'm not sure. We'll see when I open the other versions. But... Again, this is the regular version. So I'm going to take out the serial number for the event. Sadly, it's not a handshake event because of everything going on, but it is an... I got Jimin! <laughs> I saw the photo card! I got Jimin! Oh my god, I can't believe it! I never get Jimin for anything! Oh my god! So this one, I think, was the selfie version. But I got Jimin, oh my god, I'm so happy! I can't believe it! That's actually part of the reason why I bought multiple albums was to try and get Jimin, but I actually got him! Oh my god! Okay, so anyway, back to the event. It's not a handshake event. They have like three steps to the event. One of them, anyone who applies will automatically get it, and it's just basically like a showcase event, I think it was. They're probably going to like perform a couple songs, maybe do a little bit of talk. I'm not too sure exactly what it is. And then there's another one where it's like a talk show kind of thing. So they did ask people to like in send in questions, and they're going to like pick some and like answer questions through the live. As far as I know, you don't get to interact with the members, which kind of sucks, but... We'll see. I have a feeling I won't be able to get it. I don't know how many people they're going to, like, allow to win. So we'll see how that goes. And then the third one is CDs with, like, special, like, videos and stuff in it. Like, never before seen. Probably to do with, like, the album making or something. I'm not too sure. But there's the three steps for it. I don't know which ones I'm going to apply for. But hopefully I get something. 
So this is the jacket for it. It's just lyrics. There's like no pictures whatsoever in here. Oh, well, there's a design. But that's it for the regular version. I'm so happy I got Jimin. Oh my god. I swear, I'm pretty sure out of all the albums I've ever gotten, I've only ever gotten him once. Okay, next I have the Universal Music Store version. This one's cute as well. It's, I believe, the exact same pictures as the photo cards. Okay, no, they're different, but it's basically the same theme. So the CD for it, it's orange, a little slightly on the yellow side. This one also comes with a photo card, a different theme. So let's see who I got. Take out the serial number. <laughs> I got Demon! Oh my god, like what's going on? It's so beautiful. I only bought one version of this one, sadly. Like I said, these albums were expensive. They were each about $25. So, I mean, if I got a second one, I would have hoped for Hobie. But I got Jimin at least. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I can't believe it. Like, I never get Jimin. Oh my god. Okay, so now for the jacket. Just a quick flip through because it's probably gonna be like the other one. Nothing in there. There's that one little, like, design page. Different color, I think. That's basically it for the regular, like, just CD ones. And so for three more versions, there's the DVD, which is this one. So this is the DVD, and these two are two different photo book versions. So these actually have photo books this time. And there's also the Blu-ray version, but I didn't order that. It was only $5 more for the Blu-ray, but I just went for the... DVD one. I probably should have gone with Blu-ray though, but it's basically the same. So I didn't see a point in getting both because this was like $50. So definitely it was only going to be one. This is the DVD. This theme is so cute. I like it. So that's different picture from the cover and serial number. And this one comes with stickers. As far as what I understood, both of the stickers are the same for the DVD and Blu-ray. I could be wrong, but the stickers are so cute. And then there's the CD and the DVD and the lyric book with, yay, some pictures. So it looks like two for each member. Starting with Jungkook, that's surprising. They went backwards. Or you know what? I might be looking at it backwards. This is the back, so they had the order backwards, surprisingly, but that doesn't matter. Oh, that's so cute. So if I'm not mistaken, I think these are the photo card pictures. Because I know this is Namjoon's one, like I'm looking at it right now, but I put it away so I can't look at the other members. But they might be the same. But anyway, that is the DVD version. Now for photo books, let's find photo book A first, this one. So technically this is called version C, but it's photo book A. And this one, I think that the Blu-ray had a similar theme to this one. It was the black and white like this, but I didn't really look at that one too much because the more I looked at it, the more I was going to want it. Here's the inside. And then we have the CD and photo book. Just a quick flip through of it. So lyrics, oh, I think some of these pictures were teased on the Japanese Twitter, maybe. Not all of them. I'm kind of surprised there aren't more pictures, but there's quite a few of each of them. Black and white. I love black and white themes. They're so, like, I don't know how to explain it. They're so, like, sophisticated, and they're wearing suits, too, so that makes it even more, like, wow. Anyway, that was version A for the photo book. So next photo book one, I love this theme too, mainly because it's blue, but I do like that splash theme. And then here's the back. Ooh, that's pretty. And then we have the back. The inside is super colorful and pretty too. And again, they're all the CDs are all different colors. And a quick flip through of the photo book. Again, cute themes. These are actually pretty similar to what's in the DVD or on the photo cards. These actually kind of are, like I've seen them already, but there's some different ones. Ah, 
Hobie. Man, I wish I could have got Hobie's one, but I'm so happy with Jimin's. So that was a quick flip through of the photo book. And at the moment, that's all I have for the Japanese fan club one. I will post that when it does arrive. I'm not expecting it for a couple days. I'm really like upset about that. And now I can't apply for the events until they arrive which really sucks. So hopefully it doesn't take too long, not like a week or something, because I've seen them take a week between orders when I've had orders before. Who knows when it's gonna arrive, which is stupid because the website did specifically say it will all arrive on the 14th. So I don't know, we'll see, I guess, that'll arrive someday. And there was another version that I didn't order. It was on the 7Net website, which is like a 7-Eleven online website. I didn't even know that existed until they announced that they were going to have the albums on there as well. And they did have their own version. But again, these were $25. And I do have one that someone did order through me. But because it's not mine, I'm not going to open that for you guys. But this is what the cover of it looks like. And inside, it's there's no photo cards or anything. It's just different photo jackets. So you can change out the cover to like whichever member you want. Or you can keep it as the four member one. But like I said, I didn't get one just because these album, albums were too expensive. And the photo book ones and the DVD ones were just crazy, ridiculous, expensive. I did buy several of the J Japanese fan club one just because I was scared I wasn't going to get Jimin. But I got Jimin in both of these already, so I'm already happy with that. So we'll see which member I get with the Japanese fan club. So now on to the giveaway. I don't have the second regular CD yet. Because that one I ordered through the Japanese fan club. So that one is coming. So I don't know what photo card I have in it. But I will do a giveaway. Photo card included. Because it wouldn't be fair to you guys if I kept the photo card and gave you just the CD. Or if you are okay with that, please do leave a comment about that too. But I, I am planning to give you the photo card as well with the giveaway. But again, it's on the way. So I don't know which member it is. All you need to do to enter the giveaway is subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed and leave a comment down below with which album version was your favorite whether it's the dvd ones the photo book ones or just any of the cd version ones and if you see my twitter post for the japanese fan club one if that one's your favorite as well or if you've seen pictures of it online somewhere then let me know which one's your favorite and that's all you have to do to enter the giveaway i will announce the winner on friday i think the 24th Next week, Friday, Japan time. So it may be the 23rd for some of you guys, but 24th, Japan time. Again, I do want to point out that because of the current situation, I may not be able to mail it out to you right away. It might have to wait until everything's all kind of clear or when they start releasing some of the mail restrictions because Japan has a lot of mail restrictions. And you can't even send like the EMS mail, like the express shipping. So like the US, the equivalent would probably be like UPS or something like that. You can't even ship it that way. So unfortunately, it is going to have to wait. But if you're okay with that, please be sure to subscribe and leave a comment down below with your favorite album. And I will select one of the winners by next week. And I don't have a specific time. And I may not have a video out around that time. So I'm probably just going to post the comment and pin it to the top of the comment. So please check that out to see if you're the winner. I'll also leave a reply on your post itself so that you know that you're the winner. Please check your replies. I'll leave a community post as well so that there's no way you can miss it, hopefully. So please be sure to keep an eye out for that at the end of next week. And if you are the winner, be sure to send me a message on either Twitter or Instagram to let me know that it's you. And I'll keep you guys posted if I win the event or if I win the CD, which I'm kind of not expecting either of them because I don't have a whole lot of albums. I know some people buy like tens and tens of albums. And for those of you that did purchase albums through me, thank you so much. That's going to be such a big help. Hopefully it'll give me a better chance of winning something. We'll see. There will be the showcase event, which is a guarantee win. I just have to use one of my serial code numbers for it, sadly. But at least I'll get that. And we'll see if I get anything else. But again, I'll keep you posted, especially on Twitter. So if you're not following my Twitter, be sure to follow my Twitter. But that's all I have for you guys today. If you have any questions, please leave a comment down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!